Hey everyone, this is Chef Omega, and today we're gonna to be wiring up some different RTDs to some different RTD meters, and also going over some tips to wire your RTD up properly for the first time. We're gonna be using one Platinum Series meter with a PR11 probe, and one DP20 meter with a PR10 probe. We're gonna be inserting these probes into our CL1000 calibrator, which is gonna help us maintain temperature and check across the meters to make sure everything's reading right. We've already went ahead and connected these RTDs to these meters. When connecting your RTD for the first time, make sure you follow the manufacturer's wiring diagram. Then you wanna make sure that your RTD meter is programmed for the correct curve. Every RTD is different, so you gotta make sure that you follow everything to a T. A couple things you wanna check for is that your temperature reading isn't bouncing up and down. If it is, take your RTD out of the process and bench top test it. Also, make sure that your wire connections are nice and snug. Some loose wiring can also cause intermediate readings. And also, dual flex test. If your RTD probe has a cable on the end, flex them back and forth just to make sure there's no shorts or intermittent readings and everything is still reading stable. After that, you're ready to put it into process. First up is our Platinum Series meter with our PR11 probe. So I'm gonna take the PR11 probe, I'm gonna insert it into CL1000 calibrator. As you can see, the Platinum Series meter number is going up and our temperature should match. The Platinum Series has stabilized and it's matching what's reading on the CL1000. So we know that this meter is calibrated and it's ready to be used. Next up is our DP20 meter with our PR10 probe. So I'm gonna take our PR10 probe, insert it into the dry block as well. And our DP20 is starting to stabilize and it's in a couple one tenths of a degree of the CL1000 meter. So we know that this DP20 is good along with this RTD, and it's ready for process. Well, I hope today's video was helpful. If you have questions, we've got answers. Give us a call.